Hey, what's happening, guys? So, um, I haven't made a video in a couple of days, but I did manage to get some games, so I wanted to share with, with you guys really quick what I got. Uh, this is a Pokemon Pikachu, uh, Poke Walker, I think is what it's called. Um, it was given to me by a friend, the same one that gave, that gives me the, the, that gave me the PS2s, he gave me this. Um, it does not work, it does not have the battery. So I gotta change that. Uh, I have seen some go on eBay, um, but I don't really know how much they're worth. Um, if if anybody if anybody knows how much they're worth, let me know in the comments below, please. I don't know. I I, I don't know much about these. Um, so yeah, um, I managed to get some boxes out of the the GameStop dumpster, but. It's nothing big, so I won't make a, a separate video for it. It's a World of Warcraft. It's the display box, and I also managed to get Age of Wu Wushu. This is only the sleeve. I thought it looked cool, so I picked him up. It has Jet Li in the back. <clears throat> so yeah, I picked these both up. Um, next we have I got this from the pawn shop. They were trying to charge me like uh, ten dollars. They were trying to charge me ten dollars for it. Luckily, I know the girl at the pawn shop. I'm really cool with her, so I got her down to like two dollars. And uh, it's uh, SmackDown vs. Raw 2009. For all you people that don't know, I watch. I watch. I used to watch a lot of wrestling, but then there was like a period where I where I stopped watching. But now I'm beginning to start watching again. So it's kind of cool to have like all the games and shit. So yeah, um, it is complete. Uh, the game, I think I have it in my PSP right now actually. So that's pretty much it. And now the the following stuff, the following games, are the are the games that I found in the in the past dumpster diving video, like the last one that I made, where I found like a whole bunch of uh, headphones and controllers and stuff. These are the games that came out working. So I made their own little uh, custom, not really custom, but I just you know I like to slip a little uh, paper in there with the name of the of the of the game. That way I can put it in a uh, alphabetical order. And um, so yeah, the first one's uh, Madden 13. Um, it's not complete, obviously. Uh, and again, all all games do work. So I have Final Fantasy, uh, I think this is 13, if I'm not mistaken. And this one came, and I was lucky enough to find all three CDs for this, because it comes with one, two, and then one right here in the sleeve. That's pretty cool. Um, Forza Motorsport 3 comes with two CDs. They all work again. I managed to get Fable 3. I think I already talked about this game, but I'll talk about it again in case I missed it. Fable 3, I found it. Um, it does work. It does come with the with the manual. So I'm pretty psyched about that. Fallout 3. Um, another one that I found. And then this one's... This one is... Um, I was pretty shocked when I found this one. It's uh, Rocksmith... Rocksmith, uh, this is that guitar game that you that you hooked up your real guitar to your uh, Xbox or PS3, and you can basically learn how to play guitar. It's Guitar Hero, but with a real guitar. Um, supposedly it wasn't working, but I put it in the, the the PS3 and it was working just fine. So I don't know what the deal with that was. Um, I don't know. I found it. It's it's still worth like like. 25 bucks or something like that. I'm not sure. And that was pretty much all the games that I found um, in the past dumpster diving video. Now, I got these for a dollar each at the pawn shop. Some some common titles: Starkey and Hutch, and skateboard. I mean, backyard skateboarding. They both come with a little manual. What was that? They both come with the little manuals and um what else? 
and I managed to get this at Salvation Army. It's a limited limited edition Halo 2 for the original Xbox. Oh shit. Sorry about that. It is complete. And I was pretty excited I found this one. If you can see the art uh, the art in this is really cool. It's Master Chief in the back. And then uh, it was just Halo 2. You guys won't believe it for how much I got it. See if you guys can read that little number right there. I'm going to see if... $1.49. That is it. It was a, it was a 50% 50, 50 discount. It was $3, but I got the discount. So it was $1.50 for a collector's edition of Halo 2. So I thought that was a pretty cool pickup right there. Now, on my last game hunting video, I showed you my uh, my new SP, <laughs> SP, my new PSP. Um, unfortunately, I did not notice, and I only realized this like maybe like what like two days ago, no, not even like like maybe like five days ago, that the Wi-Fi switch it's loose and it does not work. So, I was pretty bummed about that, um, and the guy had on his eBay that he, d he didn't accept returns, and, you know, I did mes message him about it, and I asked him, like, you know, like, how come you didn't tell me that, um, that the, the internet switch was not working? Uh, he says that, like, he tested everything, he said everything was working, but, um, since it is broken... He he sent me a ten dollar uh, money back, so I basically got this for twenty dollars. So uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Yes, I'm probably gonna sell it. Um, I know I can at least make my money back on this, um, or I might just keep it. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this one yet. <clears throat> but on Craigslist, I managed to talk to somebody that sold me their PSP for thirty dollars, and. Um, this one is working, and it does work. the 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 Wi-Fi the, the Wi-Fi switch does work. Um, what else? That's pretty much it. it it's in pretty good condition. Um, as you can see, I'm playing FIFA FIFA Street, which is um, the latest game I got for the PSP. FIFA Street was the latest one that I got. So, um, and then, uh, I have some common titles in here. I think you guys already might know about this. I have, uh, Grand Theft Auto, Vice City Stories. I have Pro Evolution Soccer 2011. And this is the SmackDown vs. Raw that I just showed you guys. So those are the, the three games that I'm currently playing for the PSP right now. So, this is like a little, uh like a little pencil case you know a, a regular pencil case this one I actually found in one of my uh, dumpster diving videos um, I did have some pencils in there but knowing that um, I usually drop my stuff I decided just to make it into um, a little PSP case if it it's just fine in there it's padded on the inside and it does fit some games it is kind of, you know, like, ghetto, but you gotta improvise sometimes. Especially when you already wasted so much money on PSPs that you can't afford to, like, get, like, a $10 um, PSP case for it. And so that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, let's see. Um, let me update you guys on some stuff that I found in the past. You guys might remember this uh, controller. I also found this one. In the in the in my last um, dumpster diving video, and you guys you, you guys saw this one, and you guys saw uh, um, here. Let me show you guys real quick. All right, you guys saw the the PlayStation Three controller, and you saw this GameStop exclusive um, exclusive. Um, uh, this one had the wire, uh, a three sixty controller, but. It had the brand new analog sticks. 
as you guys know, if you if you watch my previous video, I managed to switch the 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 brand new analog sticks from this GameStop controller to my old 360 controller, and now it works just fine. Uh, I made a video about it. If you haven't seen it, please check it out. <clears throat> so that's pretty much it. It, it. it just saved me like what is it like forty or fifty dollars on a new controller, just by going to the dumpster. Picking out an old, uh, not even an old, it's just like an unused GameStop controller and just switching the analog sticks. This is how they used to look like, if you guys can see. And the reason why they're like that is because I played uh, for 78 hours straight. <laughs> no, no. It's because my dog uh, basically chewed them off. So, um, I was really blown about that, but I managed to switch them and now I have basically a brand new controller. And this controller was the original one that I got uh, with my Xbox, I think. It's like six years old or something like that. So I'm pretty psyched about that. And also, um, this PSP controller, um, there was something in the on the inside that was loose. So you would shake it and you would hear it. So what I did was I actually opened it up. I glued it back back together. And uh, I was lucky enough to get the, um, what is it called, the the USB that goes with the controller because it's wireless. I was lucky enough to pick that up too. So now I test it and it does work. And I, I was in I was in a need of PS3 control. So, because the, the one that I have is like really uh, messed up. I don't know why. It's, there's something wrong with it. So that's pretty much it, guys. I got a new PS3 controller and uh, basically I got um, my 360 controller back back to new again. And, um, I think that's it. I think that's it, guys. Um, let me show you guys really quick again what I got. Here, yeah, I'm just going to show you guys. I got the, the, um, the two Game Boy games, the, the brand new, well, not brand new, but in really good condition, PSP, Halo, uh, Collector's Edition, Rocksmith, Fallout 3, Fable 3, uh, this is Force of Motorsport 3, <laughs> Final Fantasy 13, uh, Madden 13, wow, <laughs> it's, it's like 3 is my lucky number, I found everything has a 3 in it, Fallout 3, Fable 3, uh, what's the other one, um, Fallout 3, Fable 3, Force of Motorsport 3, um, what else, the Smackdown vs. Raw game, and, uh, the little Poke Walker, and that's it guys, and the two controllers. So thanks for watching, subscribe, comment. Uh, and some good news, I'm five subscribers away. I got 95 today. So probably by the weekend, or maybe even less, probably in like in the next, probably even tomorrow, I'm guessing. Uh, I will have 100 followers or s subscribers. And I will make that big video that I've been talking about for the last couple of months that I hope you guys enjoy. So, um, like, comment, subscribe, tell your little friends. And that's it. Thanks for watching. I'm done.